Hey you guys, so I'm home visiting my family in Pennsylvania for a couple days and whenever I'm home it gets me thinking about my childhood and how I grew up and the dreams that I had when I was a little kid. I had an extremely long list of dreams that I wanted to accomplish when I was a little kid and at the top of my list, which I'm sure is at the top of a lot of girls list, was to grow up and be a princess. And I'll tell you what, it wasn't just for the killer wardrobe and awesome closet and Prince Charming and the whole shebang. The thing with being a princess is you get to live a life of complete adventure. If you look at all the Disney movies, every single one of those girls lived a life of complete adventure. And she sought adventure and she wanted it and they went after it with their whole hearts and souls. And I have to be completely honest, that's the part that I wanted the most. I wanted the adventure, and I wanted to get out of this town and go create a life for myself that was exciting and wonderful and that I loved living. I did pursue being a princess. I had a great opportunity when I was a teenager to work at a children's amusement park that had a fairy tale theme. And yes, I got to be the princess at that amusement park. And that job has shaped me more, more than I realized at the time. I look back now and realize that that job shaped me into exactly who I am today. The process of pursuing your childhood dreams is what's really going to change you and what's really going to matter. I fully believe there is such great value in pursuing your childhood dreams because our hearts and our spirits know more about ourselves than our conscious minds let on. I think as you pursue your childhood dreams, you grow in strength and perseverance and courage and you start to uncover these hidden talents that you didn't know you had. And that's what happened to me when I pursued this job as a princess. It uncovered hidden talents and passions that I hardly knew existed. Had I not pursued that, I never would have known that. It is one of the most thrilling, fulfilling things I have ever done and ever experienced. And that feeling is so empowering and that's what pushes me to continue pursuing my dreams and to continue setting really big goals for myself and tackling them with everything that I am. So do all dreams come true? I think yes. I am an extreme optimist and I do believe that our dreams come true. Some in really small ways and others in larger than life ways. It's just a matter of opening your eyes to see that your dreams are coming true and to enjoy it in the moment. I have to tell you the process of pursuing your dreams is where the most value is at. Yes, you may accomplish those dreams, but the process of getting there and fighting for it and going after it is what's really going to shape you into the person that you need to be and that you can be. Let's get down to it. What childhood dreams have you left untouched in your life? Here's what I want you to do. Get out a piece of paper right now and write down the first five things that come to your brain when you think of what you wanted to do when you were a little kid. I want to see things like snorkeling and growing up to be a marine biologist or being a ballerina or a rocket scientist. All those crazy wild dreams that you had when you were a little kid. Now I want you to pick just one of those and do something this week that gets you in the zone of that dream. If you said you wanted to be a ballerina, I want you to go out there and find a ballet class and take it this week. Schedule it now. If you said you wanted to be an astronaut, find somewhere that you can stargaze or go find a planetarium and get yourself in that environment and in the zone. Yes, I know it seems ridiculous and I know it seems silly, but taking these small, silly actions this week will first get you out of your comfort zone a little bit and they'll also spark your creativity and hopefully open your eyes to some of the things that you love and maybe teach you something about yourself that you didn't know existed. And maybe they'll teach you something about where your life is headed or where you secretly want your life to go. So, thank you so much for watching. It's been so fun. And leave me a comment telling me what fun thing you're going to be doing this week.